Each of our giants has had a lasting impact on our community. Tonight, we will add two very deserving men to this esteemed group. Harris Simmons and Scott Anderson are the 33rd and 34th recipient of the Giant in Our City Award, which was first presented, as I previously said, in 1970. Since then, we have honored excellence in business, exemplary generation of time and resources, and enduring love for this community. This year's honorees will be right at home with those that we have honored previously. In a world driven more and more by the immediate, Harris Simmons works diligently and patiently to create value in our community. Zions Bank Corporation has assets exceeding $55 billion and employs over 10,000 people. But the true contribution of this man is not found in the balance sheet. His contributions to our community is truly one of his great legacies. He has applied his considerable talents in finance to establish Salt Lake City's first permanent homeless shelter. He played a critical role in establishing a funding source to support the zoo, the arts, and recreational areas in Salt Lake County. He continues his service today in many of these areas and is a member of the Utah State Board of Regents, helping Utah advance on the path of prosperity. Harris Simmons is truly a giant in our city. Please acknowledge our appreciation for what he has done for us. As we honor Scott Anderson this evening, we honor a man who understands we are better than the sum of our parts. Like Harris, Scott is an accomplished professional, a respected banker and a respected community leader. And anyone who knows Scott knows of his ability to collaborate, to form partnerships, to bring people together for the greater good. We would be here long into the evening if we attempted to list all he has done his support for the Salt Lake Chamber of Downtown Rising and Prosperity 2020. I want you all to know that I wouldn't be here tonight if it were not for Scott Anderson, who does not understand the word no. His vision in creating the Utah Science Technology and Research Initiative, better known as USTAR, his leadership with the United Way of Salt Lake, and his support of the arts, is something good, if something good has happened in our area in the past few decades, I think almost everyone realized Scott was involved. He has also been a true giant in our city. Would you again join with me in a hand of appreciation?